not about the money, it's about the power. Who is this? Guillermo Vasquez. Yeah, I know. From Paraguay. Okay. B3, huh? Well, let's go B5 then. It's about fun. Modding is about fun. Seems hard to believe. Should I do here? C6? I played this with reverse colors quite a bit. Even in like half serious games. Or actually pretty serious games. Then I usually take on F3. Then I go knight e7 and I go g6. But that plan clearly doesn't work here. So I'll have to go g6 and then bishop b2 and knight f6. Maybe I should have gone like for immediate. Um, well, now that he goes for d4, I think I'm pretty fine. But I, uh, yeah, so I was going to say, I don't have the flexibility of thoughts to, uh, to go the other way. To um to come up with a new uh, come up with a new plan when uh, my regular plan doesn't work, so I'm just trying my regular plan and uh, hoping it's gonna work. Man played one b four and is gonna win. Do you mean my opponent playing b three, or do you mean a different game? Because I don't think he's going to win. Sure, he has a good position now. But will he still have a good position in 20 moves? We'll see. Uh, before I can go a5 maybe. Kind of like a5. No, so this is the plan. D4 is still weak. Like, he has a lot of potential here on the queen side, but um, I don't hate my position. It's very solid. It's like one of those Aliakin lines where you change on f3, um, and white has a big queen side, but d4 is really weak, and you're uh, very, you're, you have all your pawns on light square, so you're very solid as, as, uh, as black. I think you're misinterpreting the job. You're not interviewing to be me, you're interviewing to be a mod. A3... A3 seems a bit soft. I'll just aim for some of those squares, like C4, B5 maybe for my knights. I'm not worried about letting him into c5 because I always have knight b5 or knight f5 with counterplay against d4. He's really spending a lot of time threatening a fork and a3. And I don't th think he can protect both. Book me in for the interview, but I'm definitely not in Norwegian time. I'll have to come back to Canada. I probably will be back in Canada at some point. I liked liked being in Canada. Better than being in the US, actually. And thus, I do... I did fail the challenge of complimenting Canada without slighting the US, which I think is a very tough challenge. Uh, wait a sec, he has a knight a5. So, it's not so easy. Knight a3, there's rook a1, so I have to take with the rook. Now knight c4 takes. I will be a pawn up with reasonable uh, winning chances. 
but um, I was hoping for even more. But realistically, I don't think he'll hold. Should I go for h5, g3? Uh, okay, let's go queen b2 and then bishop d4. Or at least hoping for bishop d4. I probably just have to be patient here. I can take it, then plant the rook on the second, but don't think I should for now. Hoping for a potential rook b2. Okay, let's go rook b2, queen c6 now. Rook on b1, rook d1, we go rook b4, preparing a possible bishop d4. And we fortify the bishop with e5. And then rook b2. And magically, he, uh, he has to resign, but um, realistically, without time, it was very hard for him always there and even objectively there are some winning chances so